Before uh, constructed this uh, Ecosan toilet, uh, my family and using uh, and uh, the another toilet uh, using water. After the constructed uh, Ocosan toilet, my family and I uh, almost will forget the toilet. Uh, I preferred uh, uh, this Ecosan toilet uh, because why? Almost we don't have water in the house and second with no water the toilet the toilet is no good it's give bad smell uh, for that uh, i can using this hotel the toilets can't get 24 hour water service I think water is basic for the toilets, but they didn't get 24 hour. The amount of enrollment and expansion is taking over the capacity of water supply. Clearly there are uh, shortages, shortages uh, and complaints. Any, any shortage in electricity or disruption, uh, the pump is not working. In the campus, all toilets are flush, flush toilets. So flush toilets, if it's not flushed, then it's going to be really bad eh? and you can't accommodate it. We are uh, exposed to bad smells due to lack of water because we haven't got 24 hour service. Welcome to Ecosan Introduction. This is Atoya de Sahom. This is found in uh, Sodo Walaita. This is family unit. Just we made one ecosan toilet here. Inside, it looks like that. This is fiber made of fiber cloth urine diversion sets. Just to show, just to open, you can open with a fit. And then you can see here there is for urinal and there is for feces uh, hole. Just as soon as you come, just you can sit like that and you can urinate to the front and you can defecate just directly in the holes you know after you defecate you shall not forget everybody shall not forget just to spread some amount of ash which is sit beside and just you can like that you can spread like that that helps the faces dry very fast only for defecating he can sit here for urinating he shall not sit over there just he can come and there is urinal he can use it very easily they shall not wash themselves over there, you know, in the feces, it doesn't need any water. If, if, if there is water, if the water comes over there, it's wet, it smells, it, you know, it doesn't, uh, it's not very nice. For that, we put some holes over here and they can wash here and it will go to infiltrate. We can infiltrate just in the ground. The system, just how to sit and you can, after you use it, you can add some. Uh, ash over here you shall not put pour any water into when they mix it with urine and feces they, that makes uh, smell that's why it is separated that's why it's, here is no any smells yes, it's, there is two holes you can see it a urinal is just common there is two one hole here for one chamber the other hole for the other chamber when this chamber is full just completely you can turn this set just like that and this one is closed that you can close it for required times maybe it can 40 four months or six months until this one is full and you can continue at the new this one this one is for first six months it can be for six months they can use how it is dry you can see it, it is dry it doesn't uh, mix with urines now when it's this one is full, we are going to close this one and we will shift to the other one. This is the rotor tank where the urine is collecting, as I told you. There is some pipes coming from the urinal. This is from urinal, this is from, uh, from sitting toilet. This is coming, all is collected here and they will be collected here in the rotor. When it is full here is the some jerry can. Just you can put this, the mouse in the jerry can, just directly you can fit here. After that you can take it out. And you can bring it this one to your garden. You can use it for the garden for fertilizer. This is a system. 
bringing the urine to use as a fertilizer for me as agriculturist and as uh, ecologist i can say it's very important here there is experiment or demonstration site this one is this uh, one 10 by 10 meter with demonstration is done by urine and this one is by artificial fertilizer then there is a great variation with, with this and this this is the spike length is uh, longer than from this one relatively it is the length is also this one is uh, greater than in length also the height is uh, greater than from this this one is uh, better than this and then if you trash the the spike the number of cities also it is greater in number it is increased especially a place where soil depleted area farmers uh, they don't have they uh, they can't afford to buy fertilizer because it's expensive here is no cost. I think the here is there is a fertilizer cost here. But in this case, it is a, its cost is almost, almost transportation cost only. The problem of third country is, is the decreasing of the production yearly. The land is cultivated for a century, so it has lost its uh, fertility. So to cope the, the problem of the fertility, we use this urine and face. This uh, chemical, especially artificial fertilizer, have some impact on the soil. If people are really using compost this is give a guarantee for the soil using this waste faces and urine uh, compared to the uh, to uh, compost it is very very essential we get the dry faces and urine there is a pit here we just put the dry faces and grass grasses dry faces grasses and also there is dung uh, also the animals waste uh, also there is the house refuse just in this all of uh, wastage we make the compost to treat our soil if you use this natural uh, compost it's very uh, fruitful and the production also increased the compost the natural compost is very important from artificial better than from artificial fertilizer because of the when uh, the farmers use artificial fertilizer all in the years they must depend upon the artificial fertilizer but they make the natural compost the natural compost there is no depend upon that uh, rather than using wasting the special urine and faces into uh, uh, unused part so uh, to keep the ecology uh, to live with the environment friendly, teach the, uh, especially the, our farmers to change their attitude. So far what we have is a uh, sewage system. They, they go into uh, ponds, oxidation, oxidation ponds. Uh, that, that is uh, one way of uh, treating it. Eh? Uh, but also there are septic tanks, uh, which are really very difficult. Uh, they feel really very fast and uh, difficulty in uh, like sucking it and taking it out and dumping it somewhere else uh, so to my understanding the same thing will be continuing on the new campuses uh, because we've got in some quite sizable large area because you can't use oxygen ponds in smaller uh, compounds if you use like septic tanks it's impossible for the number of people so uh, we are thinking that way but that can't be sustainable we have to shift to new technology uh, eco-sanitation is without ecology it is very difficult to live in the world by this time because people are uh, deforesting 
the area. Uh, uh, the biomass is very de degraded. Outputs which are supposed to be waste can be used and uh, I think this, this campus can be a huge production center for that. The ecosan. It would be the best solution uh, provided uh, farmers or state farmers or whatever people can use the, the product. It would be the best solution and sustainable solution. Sorry.